of a newborn child can be devastating to a family. There's a group based here in Connecticut that wants to help those suffering families, wants them to feel as much comfort as possible. Matt Scott has more in Studio 61. Erica, this is something that uh, you and I had never had to go through, uh, uh, thankfully, but it does happen. Uh, stillborn children uh, at childbirth, uh, the loss of a child uh, is devastating, uh, to say the least. Uh, we want to talk about Riley's Resources, which is a lot of good that came out of a tough situation <laughs> for uh, Tanya J Jacoby, also Laura Young is with us both. We welcome you both. Thank you. Nice to have you here. This was, I, you know, we, we don't want to even make, suggest that this wasn't as heartbreaking as, as going through this. Take us through what happened. Yeah, so in April of 2021, my husband, Ken, and I, mm -hmm. we were pregnant with our second daughter, Riley, and we had gone to the hospital thinking we were going to be delivering our baby girl, and we arrived, and the worst sentence that we heard um, came about, mm -hmm. and I'm, it was, I'm so sorry, there's no heartbeat. And in a matter of seconds, your life changes. Change, right, as much as your life changes in anticipation of a child, it just, yeah. it just in a flash. Yeah. Uh, as hard as that is, you have managed to uh, get some good out of it, I, I, I think, by with the creation of, of uh, Riley's resources. How did this come about? Yeah, so, Actually, six months later, mm -hmm. um, after we had lost Riley, um, we had our, our living daughter, Kinsley, mm -hmm. and my husband, Ken, and I, we went to Costa Rica just mm -hmm. to get away from everything. Sure. Mm -hmm. And we decided what was helpful, like what we needed to give back. We wanted right. to do something in honor of Riley, and mm -hmm. we wanted to help other. Because this does happen uh, more than we want to talk yeah. about, more than we want to admit. Yeah. So uh, in, in the creation of the comfort box. Uh, came together. What's yeah. it, what is in this? So we give these to local hospitals mm -hmm. um, across Connecticut and across the country. And there's blankets, there's books, mm -hmm. there's journals. So mm -hmm. from the moment at the hospital, you can take notes, but then you can also go home and, and journal um, right. and start your grief journey because it's a lifelong journey. And and, and talk about for a second uh, that that journey itself, because I mean, as you go through the healing, this this helps. It, does it, those books um, you know we brought the invisible string so it's great if you already have living children at home mm -hmm. to read that book too mm -hmm. um, Zoe Clark Coates is mm -hmm. really well known in the pregnancy and mm -hmm. in philosophy yes. so having that on hand it was just really helpful uh, Laura you you went through something uh, n not the same but you you lost uh, two children uh, in uh, prem uh, prematurely I should say well, I, right. um, yes um, I've lost two pregnancies to miscarriage I so, do have a very healthy and wonderful two-year-old son um, but we've lost two pregnancies and so again and I again this is run in my family as well the, the the stories are just never good but in terms of doing good and pushing it forward. We're always amazed here when we find folks who are doing just that. And you're doing it with, with the comfort boxes. And here's the best part, you're also doing it with sushi. <laughs> yeah. seems, seems kind of out there, but but talk about what Mik, uh, Miku Sushi is doing. Yeah, so um, this month, uh, when you dine at Miku Sushi, mm -hmm. uh, proceeds from a special menu that they have mm -hmm. will benefit Riley's resources. Mm -hmm. um, the menu is to die for. Yeah. Um, there's a we beef tartare dish. We have some pictures, yeah. yeah. It's really, really good. I see some oysters, and you know, listen, I've never met a piece of sushi I didn't like. <laughs> so, uh, and, and the proceeds all throughout the month of April uh, of these four different dishes are going to Riley's Resources. Exactly, That's yeah, great. it's a great cause, and you can have a great meal, so Absolutely. it's better than that. <laughs> what's, the money, what's the money gonna be used for? Um, to supply these comfort boxes mm -hmm. to more hospitals in Connecticut yeah. and to individuals across the country. You're already tied in with the Yale New Haven Hospital, so you do. So, yeah, so yep, we are. <coughs> but we would like to get into the Hartford area, so mm -hmm. um, that is our goal, mm -hmm. and just to help more families. So again, just by eating sushi down in Greenwich, <laughs> you get to help and and, and and really do some good for uh, folks going through something that you hoped they never ever have to go through. If you'd like more information on Riley's uh, resources, we will hook you up on our website, fox61.com. Uh, Tanya Jacoby, thank you. Thank you. I, I hate meeting you for this way, but I think you're doing some wonderful stuff there. So thank you for thank, having thank us. Thank you for that. And thank you, and, and thank you Laura, as well. Thank All right.